Okay, we got this tibialis bar. This is probably one of the most slept on muscles that are worked out a lot of the times. Now, this attachment right here is so simple. It can be picked up and transfer, transported anywhere you want. It has actually two different attachments, okay? So it has the one that you can use for the Olympic weights, which is the two inch you know, hole diameter, as well as, and I'll show you here in just a sec, how to add it comes with this as well, the one inch for just the single like one inch plates. So it doesn't really matter which plates you have, at home, at your commercial gym, wherever that is, this can work for the Olympic and the one inch. So how you can use it, it's meant for the tibialis interior, but it's gonna work out a lot of other ones as well, I'm gonna show you. But you can also use it for leg extensions, but let's focus on the tibialis right now. So how do you use it is you're gonna put your feet in, and then coming a little bit closer, you're gonna see that when you lift up, you, want, you can have your legs all the way extended, but I find it a little bit easier just with a little bit of a bend. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna just lift up right here. Now this is working out your tibialis interiors. This muscle right here, hopefully you can see it. But you also have different muscles on the front of your legs as well. It's gonna be working out, if you can see this one right here, it's gonna be working out your extensor digitorum, your halicus, your, so your extensor halicus digitorum. That's this one here all the way on the side. And I think you can see this, it's your extensor halicus longus right here. So that's this one right here. So you got your tibialis interior, you got your kind of the side, you got the middle, but that's what this is gonna be working out. It's mainly gonna be working out that tibialis. I can already feel the pump just from doing it while, I, while I've been talking to you guys, because this is one of the most slept on muscles. And this thing is so well built, okay? It comes with these collars as well. These aren't mine, it comes with them. So to take them off, obviously you just push right here. Sorry guys, you gotta push down, pull off. So I had 15 pounds on. Now those were the Olympic weights. If you want to take it off because you don't have those weights, a lot of the times you're not going to be switching this back and forth because you're just going to use whatever weights you have. But the fact that it comes with both is really, really nice. So you just grab this one. You're going to screw it on. It does have this rubber cap right here, which is this plate right here. It's not metal. It's just rubber, which is nice so that when your weights are hitting it, it's not doing that loud clink, not being super loud. It'll be a little bit more damp. Screw it all the way on nice and tight. Don't need this one anymore. To be able to show you that we had 15 pounds of Olympic, we're going to put 15 pounds of the one inch ones now. Well, you know what? We're going to do 12. We're going to do 12 and a half. Sorry about that. <laughs> so that, it also comes with the one inch clip for your, uh, well, one inch ones. Goes on very tight so you know it's not going to be sliding away, which is really, really great. There you go. It's the exact same thing. So you can set this aside. You're going to be putting your feet in here. You can have your legs all the way extended. You can have it a little bit closer. You're going to lift up, get that really good contraction. But I love this. It's padded all right here. Very well built, not going anywhere. Highly recommend this. You can also use it. Uh, let's see if I can do this. Here. If you grab them like this, you can grab your weights like this at a different angle, kind of like this. And if you want, you could be using this for leg extensions a little bit better. I'm at a little bit of a worse of an angle, but it's also working out my hip extensors by doing this. So there's a lot of different ways to use this. You can tell that I'm breathing. I don't normally work out my tibialis interior. That's a hard one to do, but it's going to work out with so many different muscles. It's going to help with athletic uh, ability. Highly recommend it, and I hope you guys like it.